Okay, it's getting late now, and there could be a downpour at any moment, whereas I'm particularly little island. So I'm gonna have to really get going on my shelter now. Fucking back, it's fucking heavy. So I gotta really get going on my shelter, get some wood, find a good shelter. Oh, oh look at this, this is a, this is a haven. Oh, well this is a while big enough to make a fine shelter. So I'm gonna get cracking on this now. Oh, this is just lovely. Okay, so as you can see, I finished building my shelter. It took about two and a half minutes. So um, yeah, I'm going to catch, test out for size, and then I'm going to build a fire. So I'm in the middle of making a trap. I need of my dinner, so I did this technique and special for special forces. It's called the snare attack and basically this is going to get me my dinner. Special forces. There. Nice and tight. Okay. We're going to leave that while I make a fire and hopefully when we come back there'll be a wild boar or a tasty rabbit. Okay, okay, so... I'm scouting the area for possible sources of food. If my trap hasn't worked, we really need to sort something else, you know, but I haven't really been able to manage anything. I've got a bit of firewood over there, so I'll start cracking the fire, so, um, we're just going to have a look and uh, see what we got over at the trap. Okay, so, moment of truth, let's see if I caught anything. Yeah, there's something in it, there's something in it. What have we got? We've got a wild boar. Oh, tasty one. Oh, look at that. Oh, fuck. He's totally mangled. This would be a tasty dinner. Pork is a delicacy in the west of Ireland. They have it with cabbage or, you know, whatever's going really. So, I'm just gonna get my knife. Before I put in there. Okay, okay. We've got to get a fire going fast now or the blood will get contaminated. So, I've got to go get my fire now. Okay, so I've got a nice fireplace set up now. Um, I'm gonna have boar. Boars, as I said, are delicacy here, but got to make sure they're cooked right through. I had a friend once who ate, an, he caught an, a boar and undercooked it. He got food poisoning. Five months later, bam, car crash, he died instantly. That's the last I've seen of him, so I'm gonna make sure this baby's cooked through. This fire will be a good source of warmth and will cook my dinner. So that'll be nice. Oh, that was a lovely shelter and the finest I've had on my travels. Just having this um, lovely dream there. And, um, Okay, that dream is a bit too good. I'm not going to get into the nasties of it, but basically, Russian lesbians. I won't go any further. Anyway, early start. I've got a long hike, possibly, I don't know, 48,000 kilometers, something like that. And I've got to find civilization, get back to my bed, have a nice sleep, and look for the next adventure, I suppose. Let's get going. So still on the way back, but I'm after stumbling on something just very special. It's an old rock from, I don't know, possibly prehistoric times, and it's got this fire kind of dance. We believe it's uh, some sort of fire god to, um, I don't know, maybe they praised him to bring the, to maybe to, so they wouldn't feel his wrath, or I'm not sure, but... I don't know, he seems like a happy character in that, and um, we're not going to 
touch it or do anything to upset the fire. God, we don't want these whole forests going up around us. These trees, something special, you don't want them going at you. And then, oh my god, a bear! Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, bear, come on! Fucking bear! Bear, watch out, bear! 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 I think we lost him. I think he's gone. I think he's gone. Bear, wait up! You okay, man? I want the friend. Who got killed and raped by a gang of angry bears. I didn't want that to happen to me. I want to get back to my wife and fuck her tits. So we're gonna we're safe for now from the bear. So I showed him there's only one bear in this forest. So he can go fuck off. You look at me now, and if you look at my feet, you may be wondering why oh, doesn't he have any shoes on? Well, I'll be wearing filming. We're going across this rough train and out of nowhere, mud pit. These can be, oh, so deep, you just wouldn't know it'd swallow up a hill human. But basically, once there's pressure put on that, if you try lift it, it forms around it like cement. There's no getting them out, they're done for, so. The rest of my journey we're going barefoot and well I've got my socks luckily enough nice and woolly but um, yeah them shoes are gone so let's get going okay I've just stumbled across something brilliant this has made my day come over here come over here what we've got here is a bourbon cream bush bourbon creams grow naturally in the hills of Northwest Ireland. Full of protein and carbohydrates, chocolatey goodness. You know, you get those packaged ones and they're just not up to scratch. You've got to get these when they're fucking nice, fresh off the bus. And this will do me to, I think, I, I think we're getting close to our destination now, so there's five here. Have one there for yourself. You look skinny. <laughs> Um, we're going to have a good time with these and um, hopefully by nightfall again, I know. There's only been a few takes, but it's all been walking and not much happening. It's actually been quite a while today. So um, we're just going to hopefully just get home before find a nice bed or something, you know. So we get going.